Sample 8. Uniform flow occurs in a circular channel. Determine the flow rate if it is 1.8 meters in diameter laid on a bed slope of 0.9 meter per kilometer with material roughness of 0 0.014 for the following depths. Uh, first, 0.9 meter or half the half flow, so semicircular sections. 1.2 meters, then flowing full. Do you expect that the flow rate in part 3 is double that of part 1? So let's have the figure. This is for part 2 because we can analyze easily for parts 1 and 3. So for part 1, so we use the formula Q equals area to the 5 thirds slope to the 1 half over N perimeter to the 2 thirds, which is the same as area over N hydraulic radius to the 2 thirds S to the 1 half. So this is just the direct way so that we will not compute for hydraulic radius anymore. So for part 1, the area is area of semicircle, which is pi over 2 times radius square, or pi over 2 times 0.9 square. So it is 0 0.405 pi square meter. The perimeter is pi r if it is half full. So point pi times r and r is 0 0.9, so 0 0.9 pi meter. Substitute into the formula where the slope is 0 0.9 over 1000, so 0 0.0009 and n is already given. So 0 0.405 pi to the 5 thirds times 0 0.0009 to the 1 half over 0 0.014 times 0 0.9 pi to the 2 thirds. So the discharge when the depth of flow is 0 0.9 or half full is 1.601 cubic meter per second. So 8.2 the when the depth is 1.2 so this is 0.9 radius, so this is 1.2 minus 0.9, 0.3. Let's call the half angle as theta over 2. This is 360 minus theta. And cosine of theta over 2 equals 0.3 over 0.9. So from there, we can solve for theta, 141.06 degrees. Then the area is area of this big sector whose angle is 360 minus theta plus area of triangle. Area of sector is one half radius square times central angle in radians, while area of triangle is one half radius square sine of included angle, sine of theta. So area is one half of 0.9 square times 360 degrees minus 141.06 times pi over 180 because it should be in regions, plus area of triangle, one half of 0.9 square, one half product of adjacent side, sine of included angle, sine of 141.06 degrees. So the area is 1.802 square meter, while the wetted perimeter, which is this, is radius times central angle in regions. So perimeter is radius, central angle 360 degrees minus 141.06 degrees times pi over 180. Let's convert that to region. So perimeter is 3.49 meters. So everything is calculated. So we now substitute Q equals 1.822 to the 5 thirds quantity 0 0.0009 to the 1 half over 0 0.014 times 3.439 to the 2 thirds. So the discharge is 2.510 cubic meter per second. Then for number T, if it is full, then the area is pi r square, pi 0.9 square, 0.81 pi. So we expect that the discharge will be double this because the area is doubled. The perimeter is also doubled. The perimeter is pi d, 1.8 pi. So substitute. Q is 0.81 pi to the 5 thirds quantity 0 0.0009 to the 1 half over 0 0.014 times 1.8 pi to the 2 thirds. So the discharge is 3.202 cubic meter per second, which is double that of part 1.